Begin your shift by asking yourself, how and who will I wow today? Now, you can define your shift as when you clock in at work, or you can define your shift as when you wake up in the morning. For me personally, my shift is when I wake up. Because when I wake up, it's a big deal. <laughs> like, you mean I woke up again? <laughs> Are you serious? <laughs> I have yet another day to do something? <laughs> Don't take that for granted. There are some people who are here yesterday and they are not here today. Some who are alive yesterday that are not alive today. Don't, that right there that you woke up is a blessing. Right, that, that's huge. Embrace that. Don't let this day go to waste at all. How and who will I wow today? Now when I say wow, I don't mean a bow wow. <laughs> a big wow. I'll give an example. <clears throat> I was in a hotel in in. in where was I? In Stockholm. I was in Stockholm, Sweden. I'm in Stockholm, and every morning at the buffet breakfast, this, the, the guy, the breakfast cook, was making a wonderful um, Indian spy, uh, chai oatmeal. Yeah, it was good. <laughs> yes, I would get that every morning. Right? On the day I was leaving, when I came down to get that Indian chai oatmeal, he gave me the oatmeal, but guess what else he gave me? The recipe. The recipe. And you know what? Your name is? Autumn. I have a gift for you, because Autumn spoke up first, so I have a gift for Miss Autumn, a copy of my first book. <clears throat> my family and I went to, um, to Bali a few times. I have clients in Bali. In fact, our second child's name is Bali. <laughs> he wasn't conceived in Bali, so it was Miss Bali. It means mighty warrior. So it was my wife and I, it was our 10 year anniversary a few years ago. So we were in Bali and we went to this restaurant, it's out on the beach overlooking the Indian Ocean. Just us, just her and I on this thing, the special dinner. And the service bringing all these wonderful dishes and we were like, can you believe this? This is so nice. So we're taking pictures with our phone of each other. And then the service said, may I take a picture for you? He said, yeah. And then the service said, may I take a picture with the hotel camera? I said, oh sure. So we're like cheesing it up. By the time we got back to our villa, right, <clears throat> got into the room, there's rose petals on the floor leading into the bathroom, and there's more rose petals in the bathtub, and a heart shape, and the candles, and all that. Then there were more rose petals from the tub over to the bed, and on the bed was a framed picture that they had just taken at dinner. Is that a wow? Yeah. Yes. And there was a handmade book that the staff had made, and each staff had, uh, wrote happy anniversary in their own native language. Was that a wow? Yes. yes. You see, the real testament of something being a wow is, is if the guest says, wow. <laughs> Isn't that deep? <laughs> if the guest says wow, it's a wow. So when we say creating lasting memories, wow people. Wow. And it's just a, ma a matter of using your creativity leveraging each other. One of your ideals is about working together, right? Leverage, you can't create service excellence by yourself. Leverage each other's strengths.